Hey guys, we're doing some product testing at the legendary Corriganville Ranch. And this was just too cool to pass up. I had to show you this. This spot behind me right here, this was actually the lake that they filmed the creature from the Black Lagoon in, the original movie, and the camera holes for the water are still there. So check this out. And if you see down here, those holes right there were actually where a camera crew would hide out and videotape the Black Lagoon scenes of the movie here. So for testing such revolutionary product, we had to be at a revolutionary spot that changed the game for cinema forever. Some of the greatest Western movies ever made were filmed here. And this is where we're gonna do our product testing. Well, today we're gonna be testing out the all new Crew Core with the Crew Cocoon insulated tents. So as you can see, we got our ground cover set up here. It's really cool. Come on in, Drew. So in your crew box, they're gonna include these awesome tent stakes. They got a whole bag of them right here. They're super easy to put in the ground. So they come with a ground cover, and then the tent actually just rests on top of it and uses the same stake. So it's really convenient. It also included this awesome hand pump. So we're gonna get to pump it and let you know how long this thing takes to get set up. Our product test team member, Drew, right here, testing out the hand pump for the crew of tent. As you can see, the whole thing inflates via air, which is really cool and allows it for quick inflation. The hand pump was included in the tent. And we are gonna show you how to, just how easy it is to set up the Krua Duo and connect it to the core over here. But this is the Krua Duo. Boom! Our duo is set up. We're gonna connect it over here to the core. So we built the core tent uh, and we've got the uh, cocoon inside of the duo, but now we're gonna step it up a notch and turn this whole thing into apartment complex because the duos actually connect to the core. We're gonna demonstrate how easy that is right here. One bedroom's done. So you saw us set up the large crew of tent earlier. Now we're gonna show you how to stuff the crew of cocoon into the core tent. And then the awesome thing, we're gonna connect it all so that it's got bedrooms. So here we go into the tent. It's also air flown just like the core that we blew up earlier. So I just wanna demonstrate, we got it already hooked up. You see the cocoon's just thrown inside. It's super soft, a lot like a sleeping bag. And when it gets set up, it completely blacks out the inside of the tent and it creates an entire insulation that uh, crew had designed for their tent line. So it's pretty much the same thing as the core. Close up the valve here. The cool thing about these valves is they actually don't leak when the air pump is dismantled from it. So it's a two layer core. So if you unscrew this one, that'll actually let the air out. But the pump one, it doesn't let any air out when you blow it, which is pretty cool. All right, so it's all pumped up. We let the girls have a chance to pump it for a little bit. So we sped it up. So come and check out how cool it makes the inside of it look. So it completely blacks it out. So you don't have that annoying like sun waking you up in the morning kind of thing. Unless that's your vibe, which is no problem. If you could see it in the back there, there's that orange zipper. It actually allows you to open it up uh, and create some, uh, some airflow just and it goes along with the tank. And then it fits right in there nice and snug. So now we're gonna take this over, connect it to the core, and we've got our whole thing done. As you can see, we got a bedroom off over here on the right and a bedroom off over here on the left. You can't see it, but there's actually one in the back too. So we have turned this crew of core, the air inflated core tent unit, into a three bedroom, 
awesome hangout tent space, which is great for the kids, great for summer camping. You got some friends and everything. It really is an awesome tent for a big group. So we're gonna walk you on the inside of it and show you what's what. You'll notice first here, you have this awesome patio area. If you come in, Drew, you'll see that the patio area also has vents. So you can allow air to come in and out, walk out from the sides if you want to, because the whole front actually closes too. So you got it, you can see right here, we've got it tied up. So if you were to close the front, you could actually enter from either side as well, which is really cool. So you can have this as an enclosed patio space, do your little barbecue out here, relax out here, put a little lantern in the middle, you're good to go. Let me show you the inside. All right, come on into the, the crew of core. So the first thing that I noticed when I got inside of this thing was that I could stand up which is pretty cool. I'm gonna ask my team member, Reno, would you mind grabbing this door for me? Mm -hmm. Thanks, buddy. All right, so I can stand up. I'm five foot 11. Uh, I got boots on, so let's call it six feet, and I I'm perfectly fine. You've got vents on the top that allow for plenty of circulation and a really cool uh, plastic vinyl right here. So even with the rain cover on, uh, you still have plenty of spots to just stare up at the stars. This also creates, if you're only going to use the bedrooms, you have an indoor lounge area too. So imagine, if you will, a little uh, barbecue in here. You got the chairs mounted around it. Maybe a little projector up on one of the walls. You got plenty of space. What I do want to highlight is the room connections and just how different it is when the cocoon is inside of the core. So follow me in here, Andrew. So the first one I'm going to show you is the uh, crew duo that does not have the cocoon in it. So check this out. So first thing you'll notice, this is just really, really cool about this, this unit, is that there is a complete sealed connection. There's no way water's getting in here. Go ahead, get up in there if you'd like. That actually zippers from the outside and then has an additional layer that covers over the zipper. So you got a waterproof zipper layer plus a waterproof cover that goes over it. So this is totally awesome for the kids to walk around in. The bottoms here actually just Velcro together, as you can see. It allows so that no water is going to get into this thing because this is about, I mean, at least uh, four to six inches up off the ground. So there's no way water's pouring into this thing. I'm going to head into the duo here, which actually has a double layer. So you've got the mosquito guard on the inside and the outside vinyl layer. Now, this is a non insulated core here. So come on, Andrew, let's get cozy with each other. This is the crew duo. Plenty of space. Two, two grown adults can lay down in here with kiddo. You got an air vent in the back or a little puppy hatch if you want. Plenty of pockets for all your goodies. Uh, and then you've also got a hang here for a lantern on the top. The thing that I love about this is I it's about 42 degrees outside right now and I feel nothing inside of here. It's fantastic. Uh, these don't even have the rain guards on them. So right now, that's without the additional protection and I'm nice and warm and cozy. We had all the little girls playing in here. There's about uh, seven of them running around outside uh, and, and they were all just going in this thing like, and it was awesome. So now we're gonna head behind you and that is the uh, duo with the cocoon in it. So let's check that out. All right, so this is the third bedroom I was talking about in the back. Same setup here. Now this right here, this is the cocoon, zipped up. As you can see, it's basically a sleeping bag material that actually inflates with the air pump, just like the core tent, and rests inside of the tent. It's super insulated, so it creates a really warm environment. And then if it's super hot outside, it actually will absorb that heat because the outside is the gray uh, absorbing and then the inside is black and it's UV resistant. So the really cool thing is if you look in here, look how much darker that is than the one that we were just in. And it is cozy. I got to play in there. So I want to thank our friends from Krua for sending us over this material. We've loved playing with it. Thanks for checking out the Krua tents.